guys, it's Christina, and I am here with Lucy Hale. How are you? Hi, I'm and good. And you brought some furry I've, friends with you. I bought Fluff and Frozen. Oh, I, they are just yeah. so Aren't cute. Aren't they delicious? Oh my god, they are from I'm the obsessed. ASPCA. And you can adopt dogs just like these up at the Upper East Side at 92nd Street at the ASPCA. They are just the cutest little things I in the know. world. I They're know. so cute. <laughs> so I uh, partnered with Honey Nut Cheerios. Yes, you did. And uh, for the Good Rewards program. And my charity of choice was the ASPCA, mm -hmm. hence these really cute little dogs. Yeah. Um, and so what you can do is you buy a box of cereal, you donate your buzz coin, you choose a team, uh, you scan your buzz coin, rather. Yeah. And, uh, and choose your team, which hopefully you choose mine. Definitely. And it's it's ongoing until April, and um, the team with the most buzz coin gets a hundred thousand oh dollars uh, given to their charity of choice. That's great. So how could you say how no? How could you say no to these to faces? These, I feel like they're super. Hung oh, she, she's got the hiccups. Oh. Or he? Yeah, he's got the hiccups. Oh. <laughs> and yeah. you are also going up against some other celebs, right? Yes. So this is a Rob competition. Rob Gronkowski and mm -hmm. Michael B. Jordan. I'm currently in second place. Okay. I'm a sore loser, so I'm hoping <laughs> well, after that I'll today. slide on into first yes, after today. Totally. Yeah. And why are um, animals so important to you? You know, I've always, my family was just, <laughs> was huge animal lovers growing up, and mm -hmm. that I just grew up with a lot of animals, and yeah. I think that they're so pure and innocent and loving oh. and forgiving to us, and they don't always get a voice. Yeah. So mm -hmm. um, that's where the ASPCA steps in and Definitely. protects protects these guys. Oh, I know, you, just I know, you wish to play. You just want to run. Tell me all about your yeah. dog. Uh, so I have a dog mm -hmm. who is almost three. His name is Elvis. He's a Malty Poo. Oh. Um, just like the light of my life. Aww. I love him so much. There he is. Um, I'm from Memphis and mm -hmm. I love Elvis Presley. So. <laughs> I mean, he's got like a wizard face. Like, yeah. He looks like an old wizard. He's so <laughs> wise. How would you describe his personality? Oh, he's such a lover. I've never met a dog who has to be like so human, yeah, yeah. like as close as humanly possible. Um, but really mischievous too. And yeah. he's very smart. Like I should have named him Houdini because I'll <laughs> put him. I used to like cage him off in my kitchen when I'd leave, and he just finds a way, just sneaks finds out. Him. Yeah, oh, I still I don't that. know how. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just the one dog. Just one dog. Just one as dog. As of now, but now I'm like, I know. I'm gonna say after today. Oh, honey. Oh, yeah. I know. <laughs> I know. Do you want some treats? Ooh, treat hey, treat time. Treats would be good. Treat yum, time. Yum. Treat break. <laughs> treat break for us all. Here we oh, go. Here we go. Here we go. Some I know that's what you want. Dried pork. <gasps> mm. So good. Yeah. How's your new year going so far? New year's good. Yeah. We were laughing because everyone's like, 2019 is my year. And yeah. I, but I really feel like it's. It was 2018 was strange for a lot of reasons, but I feel like it is going to be a good year. I'm excited. Good, yeah, lots definitely. Of fun things happening. Mm -hmm. and yeah, yeah. we got a lot of things going. I'm going right. to move these because we're going to eat these later. Yes, of course. Um, do you have any <laughs> New Year's resolutions? I always try not to set them, but I, it's always tip, like the same stuff. Read more, stay mm -hmm. off my phone, uh, travel more. Because I'm always like saying I'm going to do things, so now it's actually I should actually do those do things. <laughs> and I also start a lot of projects and don't finish them. Okay. So maybe it would be to, to finish sure. the task at hand. Yeah. <laughs> Do you set any workout goals for yourself in the new year? Um, I Well, last year, one of my resolutions was run a marathon, and I didn't do it. Okay. So not setting one this year, but <laughs> I'm always okay. trying to, like, expand what I do and, sure. and find new hobbies, whether that be working out or, yeah, yeah, or something. Yeah, definitely. So, yeah. You said 2018 was a strange year. How come? Oh, you know, yeah. you know, you know why. <laughs> yeah, without really diving in. Sure, yeah. Yeah, you know, <laughs> keep it PC. <laughs> keep but <laughs> but yeah. good things ahead. You have a lot Definitely of uh, projects good coming up. Yeah, I start filming a movie called Fantasy Island. Hi, guy. Mm -hmm. um, called Fantasy Island in a couple weeks. Okay. Um, I That's wrapped with Michael up, Pena, right? Yeah, Very yeah. Fun. He plays Mr. Rourke, which will mm -hmm. be fun. Um, wrapped up a movie about a month ago, which will come out later this year, called A Nice Girl Like You. Okay. Have a film coming out called The Unicorn. It'll be coming out shortly. Okay. So yeah, lots of exciting things. That's so exciting. Yeah. Tell me all about Fantasy Island. What? So it's it's was a popular show right. in the. 70s? Mm -hmm. I should know this. <laughs> um, and uh, so we're taking that concept, which is all these guests get to go to a remote island and their wildest fantasies come true. That's so fun. Um, so we're taking that concept and completely flipping it on its head and making yeah. it really dark and scary and 
and exciting That's gonna and be really thrilling. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. You're also turning 30 this year. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel you about know it? What? I I'm actually excited. Yeah. Cuz I feel like everyone always said your 30s are amazing. Mm -hmm. And I really do think that. I think the 20s are making all your mistakes, getting right. that out of the way, figuring out who you are, mm -hmm. and then your 30s are about owning it and loving it and not worrying about all the stuff you used to worry about. That's good. So you feel totally good about I'm it. I'm ready. Go Bring ahead. on. Yeah, yeah. I know. Because yeah. for me, I was like, oh, I don't know if I can do this. I don't know if I can do this. I'm, but then you get there, and it's yeah. okay. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, you know, things are different. You know, you have, like, a timeline for yourself. Sure. And, like, things aren't always what you expect it to be, mm -hmm. or it's just a little bit different. But, yeah. Yeah, definitely. I'm ready. Is it fun now focusing a little bit more on movies? Because TV has been such a focus for so many years. Yeah. I, I love TV, mm -hmm. and I would, you know, the hope is to find another great TV project yeah. soon, but um, but film is fun because <laughs> I know, I know. I'm hungry that. too. I feel like they're crying because they're hangry, I and I'm like I am too. Um, <laughs> He's literally just biting my hand. Here, so. more treats, more treats. Um, I just went brain dead. And I can't remember what you just asked me. <laughs> Neither can I. <laughs> <laughs> Neither can. Oh, you're focusing more on movies now. <laughs> right, right, right. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I I love getting to try different characters yeah. and getting to to bop around and do all these different things whereas TV you get to live with a character sure. longer mm -hmm. um, with the films I've been doing there's more creative freedom which is mm -hmm. fun because with TV there are all these you kind of have to sometimes like live in this box yeah. of what you can do Definitely. but you know I'm just sort of grateful for any opportunity mm -hmm. and yeah we'll out see of what all the characters next. that you've played so far what's been your favorite <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I played a, a character this last year on a show called Life Sentence. Right. Her name was Stella. Mm -hmm. um, it was just really fun. Tonally, yeah. it was really different. I got to do more of the comedy, and mm -hmm. um, she was just really optimistic and quirky and fun. Yeah. So was it hard to say goodbye to that show and yeah. that cast? Yeah, I still get sad about it. Yeah, I know because um, you said you were a little shell shocked when. You yeah, know that it was a bummer, but. That's okay. I made some really good friends. Mm -hmm. Opened up a lot of doors. Definitely. So, yeah. yeah, you still keep in touch with the cast. Oh yeah, that's yeah. good. And same with Pretty Little Liars. Right. Too. Like I, was I just still say. Mm -hmm. talk to everyone. Do you still talk? Yeah. yeah. Is there still like a group chat of Pretty Little Liars? We haven't group chatted in a while, <laughs> but um, I talked to Troy the other day. Mm -hmm. I talked How's to. How's she doing with the baby? Oh, good. I good? think. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, I talked to Janelle quite a bit. They're okay. in Portland shooting the spinoff, so. That's great. Yeah, yeah I, um, I mean, I wanted to get your thoughts on the spinoff. What do you think about it? I don't know much about it, to be mm -hmm. honest. Oh, I, oh, what do you think about that? <laughs> um, I don't know much about it. I'm equally as curious as everyone yeah. else as to what they're doing, doing with it, but um, I think the fans of, of the show will be happy because I yeah. think it's they segue it nicely and mm -hmm. it'll totally be very similar. Do you think you'll be a part of it at all? Maybe. Maybe, um, yeah. This season, no. Mm -hmm. um, but there's always the possibility Sure. I know that. people always yeah. talk about reunions and always want a reunion to happen. Do you think a Pretty yeah. Little Liars reunion will happen I, in the future? I think one day yeah. we will. I mean, I we have to like have people miss it. Like right. it has to be off sure. for long enough to have people miss it, mm -hmm. but I'd be open to it. Yeah, yeah I think, think it'd be fun. Where do you think Ari and Ezra would be today? Um, I got asked that earlier, and I was like, she's definitely a really rich novelist living in a castle. I don't know where there's castles in the United States, but uh, yeah, she's just like living her... Living her best life? Living her best life, absolutely. <laughs> what do you miss the most yeah. about that show? Um, I mean, it's vague, but the people. Yeah. I mean, you get so comfortable, eight years of being with, on the same set. Mm -hmm. Like, we, you know, we got really close, so yeah. just seeing them every day and having that support, I think. Definitely. Yeah. Well, you guys kind of like grew up together, too. I yeah. Mean, you've been, oh, literally. Yeah. yeah. We've spent our 20s on right. the show. You, I so. mean, you've been through, you know, marriages, heartbreaks, and All of everything it. in between. All of I it. mean, it yeah. was it good to have that support system during that time? It was, because we were yeah. all sort of going through the same things at the yeah. same time, so we could sort of rely on each other and lean on each other if we needed to. Mm -hmm. um, but it was cool. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Music in the new year at all? Potentially, Potentially yeah. yeah. I, uh, I'm still, obviously love music and it's a huge part of my life. But um, finding interesting ways to to utilize it, whether it be theater or mm -hmm. yeah, we'll see. Definitely. I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, because Broadway's always been something that you've wanted to do, right? Eventually, yes. I mean, that would be a dream. A dream. Yeah, mm -hmm. it would be so fun. <laughs> Definitely. And nerve wracking, I'm and sure. But <laughs> we lost a bandana. Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> oh goodness. <laughs> Well, thank oh, you, you so much you. for coming by and thank bringing you. these guys. Thank you, of course. Like I said, the, uh, puppies like these are available 
uh, for adoption at the ASPCA yeah. up at the 92nd Street on the Upper East Side in New York City. So if you are in the area and you want a puppy, go and check them out. And um, to vote for you, go to BeGoodRewards.com to vote for your team. Thank you. Yes. yes. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Now you can eat all the treats you want. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> we're done. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry.